We're in Cisco ASA version 9. I'm going to show you how to create an access group. Now an access group will allow the access list to be bound to an interface. So an access list isn't going to do anything for inbound or outbound traffic until you bind it to an interface. So if we do a show run access group, we can see what is the current binding and that is going to be 101. So if we do a show run access dash list 101, it tells us all the traffic that's tied to that. So we're going to go ahead and change that and we're going to change this to inbound. And you can see we have only one inbound access list which is an email access list going to our email server. So in order to get this to be bound to the outside interface, we need to type in access group inbound in interface outside. Now if we do a show run access group, we can see it's our new access list called inbound which is bound to the outside interface. If we want to, we can also do the same for the inside interface if we want to bind any particular access uh, list to that particular interface. So every interface can only be bound to one access list.